Sunday, yep. Saturday, and Sunday. Though, I think the reason it was awesome was that we were sitting there on, like, Saturday night. It's, like, 3 in the morning, catching the last shuttle bus back to our hotel. I know 3 a.m. at this con is the same energy level as 3 p.m. Yep. The con doesn't die out till about 6 a.m. It does have amping up periods, you know, obviously in the prime time yeah. hours. But, like, 6 a.m. to 10 a.m. is the only quiet-ish time. Mm. And even then, there are people playing games in the lobby. Yep. But... We're standing outside, and in the hotel, there's like, raw, raw, and you hear it through the doors. And then off in the woods, between us and the other hotel, you hear one guy just like, what? <laughs> off in the distance. Yeah. That was the moment. That's pretty awesome right that there. Was, that was like my moment at that con. That was good. All right. I had a lot of fun at MAGFest. I did have quite a bit of fun there, but I don't know. Is it worth two vacation days? Maybe I go back, but I just go back Friday. Or See, the thing later is, Thursday after work instead of taking Thursday off. All MAGFest brings to the table, to be perfectly honest, is the venue and the culture. Yep. And the, and the arcade room. Yep. Everything else, I guess, and the concerts, but the concerts were impossible for us to go to because you couldn't bring a bag in, there's a wall of BO, and the room was tiny. Mm-hmm. But they simulcast the concerts on the hotel TV to anywhere they wanted that to watch it. That was pretty cool. So every hotel room that a room party just had the concerts going on the TV. That was very good and very clever. Um, but yeah, other than that, it's like Mag, not, MAGFest itself doesn't bring anything else to the table, right? So it's like, I already have two packages on my schedule. Do I really need to go? Well, I think if MAGFest <laughs> fixed itself... Right? They fixed some of their logistical situations, professionalism. Right? Move to a real venue. Yeah, I, might, I would be willing to go back if it improved and give it, you know, another shot just because it was a lot of fun going on there. I don't know if I take Thursday off work. I might go Thursday after work. Right? Yeah, maybe. Um, but yeah, I mean, you know, it was sort, it's sort of on the borderline, right? It wasn't, it had big problems, terrible reg, terrible BO, but... It I, gets a lot of points for just the fact that I don't go to any hotel cons. I want one hotel con in my repertoire every year. Yeah, so if, you know, if they keep upping their game, you know, I'll keep going back and helping them up their game. But if it gets worse or stays the same, I don't think I can, I, I can invest, you know, in it as much yeah, as... Yeah, that as reg necessary. line was unforgivable. Yeah. And I worry because they're at a point where their venue sucks, they have to move. They'll have to move into D.C., where suddenly the laws are much more like real cities. They can't get away with the B.S. they got away with in Alexandria, Virginia. Yep. We'll see if their professionalism uh, is, the, is the doom of them, or lack, their, or lack yeah, of professionalism because dooms them Because we can say this. The, Tim, the guy who runs panels, knew what he was doing. Like, he, like, every problem that we could have pointed out, he was already aware of and wanted to fix. Yep. But... It's a kind of a Katsukan situation where, like, Video Katsu, the guys we were with, was, like, its own unit that itself was competent, but much of the rest of Katsukan had serious problems that serious eventually drama. exploded. And we definitely heard whisperings and rumblings of drama in the high levels. Yeah, we will not get into the things that we know that we have learned from going yeah. to MAGFest. And there is some crazy drama and just also, you know, behind the, the veil. the number of staff, I mean, the culture of staff wasn't, like, a, a bad culture, like the Otakon staff culture. But it wasn't a culture professionalism. It's like they had the right attitude about gaming and all that stuff, but they didn't necess- They weren't like on top of their game in terms of you know, let's work really hard to make everything the best. It was more like, oh man, we made a. Re- they're really good at making a funny commercial. Yeah. They're not really good at managing a line. But they had a lot of good staff who were new, like old Katsukan staff after the explosion. A lot of the people that we used to work with at Katsukan were now staff in this. Yep. A lot of the really good people. Yep. So we'll see how it goes. It's hard to say. To wait and see on the next MAGFest.